everybody welcome to my channel I'm Christy this is Quincy and today I've got a grocery haul for you guys it's gonna be keto low carb and diabetic friendly I don't know about you but I love to watch grocery hauls it gives me the opportunity to see what everybody else is picking up if anyone's found new items and it also helps out especially if you're stuck in a rut and need some ideas what's wrong buddy what's wrong I had to pick him up because he's chasing Mira. If this is your first time tuning in, I'd love to have you as a subscriber. Make sure you hit that notification bell so that as soon as I upload, you'll be alerted. Follow me over on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook group. I'm everywhere, guys. I'll have it down below for you in the description box. That way you can click on the links and it'll take you right on over. But you're going to find additional content on those platforms that's not posted over here. While you're in the description box, make sure you scroll through. I'm going to have some of my must-have keto items down there. Things that have made my weight loss journey easier, like my air fryer. And I'm going to have lots of discount codes that I've got from keto companies for you guys so that we can save some money on some of our favorite products. Disclaimer, I go to multiple grocery stores in my area because you know as well as I do, not one grocery store is gonna carry everything that we need. We're on a specific health journey. I wish there was just a low carb keto store where we could get it all, but unfortunately there's not. So be prepared to see multiple hauls in today's video. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. Quick reminder before we get started with the video that Perfect Keto did launch their new chocolate cereal and when they launch a new product, there's usually a sale. Right now, if you buy three or more items, you're gonna be able to save 25%. You can mix and match products and everything will be linked in the description box. Great time to stock up on your collagen. But if you're watching the video after April 17th, don't worry, I got you covered. There's always gonna be a Perfect Keto discount below. Walmart haul, not too big this week, but I did want to show you a few things that we picked up. Some of those things are going to be non-keto items, so be prepared. My store actually had a few trays of chicken in, three to be precise. I went ahead and got one, didn't want to be stingy and buy every one of them. Purdue chicken breast tenderloins, free range, 1.2 pounds is going to be $6.41. And I also picked up a Tyson's slow cooker kit. I've never picked up one of these before. Pork roast with vegetables, boneless pork roast. I'm thinking since Chris is at home and we're not doing anything big for Easter, this is going to be our Sunday dinner. It does have carrots and potatoes and onions and celery in here but there are people in my family like the kids that aren't doing low carb or keto. So this will be perfect. Picked up a heavy whipping cream. They actually went down at my store. They were $3.86. Last time I was at Walmart, they were about $4.10. This is the ratio keto friendly yogurt. It is going to be a thick consistency. They do have a variety of different flavors. My favorite are coconut and strawberry. So I picked those up. They were about $1.30. Macros on these are going to be two carbs. It's going to have 15 protein and 15 fat. Eggs, we'll probably dye these for Easter or I will make some deviled eggs with this. I'm not a huge deviled egg kind of person, but Briley and Preston are, so went ahead and picked those up. They finally had in the sugar-free whipped heavy cream, got four. These also went up at my store normally $1.88, right now $1.98. Here's your ingredient list in case you wanna pause it and check it out. It is gonna be sucralose sweetened and there's your nutritional information. Needed some sour cream, pretty much add this to everything. Went ahead and got one of those and got a 12 pack of the Alani New Cherry Slush Energy Drinks. They have them available in multiple different flavors. My favorite though is the Cherry Slush. I think they also have one that's blue, blue slush. It's good too. This one, Hands down, my favorite. Non-keto items, we picked up some of the tumblers. Got two of those. The blue one is gonna be a color changing. And this pink one, I don't think it is. They were around $6. These are like your Starbucks cup dupes. We just saw one at Starbucks. It was $25. It was smaller than this. 
and I refused to buy it. So when Briley saw these for $6, I was like, sure, grab one. But mostly because if you look right there, 26 ounce tumbler, dishwasher safe, top rack only. If it's not dishwasher safe, I'm not gonna buy it because I'm not gonna wash it. These were on an end cap and they had tons of different colors available. The last thing that we picked up at Walmart today was something that Briley got. And this is the Kraft Macaroni and Cheese Limited Edition Ice Cream. I, um, there are no words. I can't even imagine. She loves macaroni and cheese. She loves ice cream. But I cannot even imagine what this would taste like. It says French ice cream. They also had pizza flavor. There was something called earth. Lots of different types that aren't traditional type ice creams were available. I'll keep you posted on this one. It's everything that we picked up at Walmart this week. Only a few items from Aldi this week. Needed some shredded lettuce. Briley likes this for salads. So this just gives me the opportunity to throw it on a plate and go. They also had their green beans. These are the French green beans. You need to fix these in your air fryer. You're gonna cover them with oil. You're gonna add some seasonings and some Parmesan cheese, and then you're gonna stick them in the air fryer and cook them. They are absolutely amazing. They're like little green bean fries. You can even make a dipping sauce for them. They're so good. Also in the air fryer, you gotta be making your mushrooms. This is the Baby Bella. I'll cook those with oil, and then I'll put steak seasoning on those just like you would get at a steakhouse. Finally had in the unsweetened almond milk. They haven't had this in what seems like ages. I picked up one of the vanilla. Aldi has my favorite almond milk. So when I go, if they have it, of course I pick it up. I almost ran over this poor man with a walker when I realized they had in almond milk because I was not paying attention. I was so embarrassed. Also got a jar of the deli sliced mild banana pepper rings. Nothing's added into these so you don't have to worry about sugar or anything. I picked these up for mom because she had asked me to get them next time I was at Aldi. Now where they have the banana pepper rings, they also have the jalapenos and you guys know I love those. Okay, one more thing that I picked up, the outdoor rugs. They had spring, they did have some Easter ones left, and then I picked up this one with the bicycle that said welcome. They even had one with a little truck that was about that color. This thing, like I said, is huge. Huge. I'm gonna put it out by the front door and it was only $8.99. That's it. Tiny Aldi haul. We do not have a super Target in my area. It's just a regular Target and they do have the little coolers. In the back, they have milk, pizzas, a few ice creams and things like that. But they have heavy whipping cream and the heavy whipping cream at my store is only $2.99. So every time I'm in the area, I go ahead and pick one up because that's the cheapest I've ever been able to find heavy whipping cream. I'm embarrassed to even mention that I picked up LaCroix, but I did. And only because they had this eight pack of sparkling LaCroix lime on clearance for $1.96. The only way I'll drink LaCroix is by mixing other things with it, like Jordan's skinny syrups, the liquid water enhancers, heavy whipping cream, things like that. Drinking these by themselves is, it's not even possible. You have to mix it with something. Okay, that was it. Two little old items from Target. Oh, I also picked this up at Target in the dollar section, although it was $3. This is basically just decor for these like little farmhouse tiered stands. So it has like a little box in here with stars, a little shadow box with a star and some beads. You know, as much LaCroix as I'm buying lately, I may have to change my statement that I detest LaCroix because apparently I'm now obsessed with LaCroix. This is my grocery haul from United Grocery Outlet or Go. It's a discounted grocery store that's in my area. I think it is mainly in the South. I found some exceptional deals. So if you have a United Grocery Outlet, run to yours and see what they have. First thing that I got was the LaCroix. This one is gonna be the Kiwi Watermelon. There are eight tall cans in here and it was only $1.99. So for those of you wondering, there's your nutritional information and your ingredients. If you've not tried the LaCroix with adding all of the extras to it, you need to. I have several drink videos that I've posted, so make sure you go check those out. If you have seen those, you know what I'm talking about. 
Let me know what skinny syrup or what flavoring should I add to the LaCroix Kiwi Watermelon. I need your help guys. Let me know in the comments. So I stocked up on the Wide Awake Coffee Company Cold Brew. They had the light roast, the breakfast blend, and the dark roast. I got three of the light roast and three of the dark roast. This is not a concentrated, it's just the cold brew. So each one of these is gonna be four servings. That'll look like this cup right here. I'll show you the information on the back, but the most important thing is they were only only a dollar 49 each ingredients reverse osmosis water and coffee Four 12 ounce servings, zero calories, zero fat, zero carb, zero everything. Of course, I wanted to go ahead and open one, try it, make me an iced coffee to see how it tastes. It's awesome. Only thing I added to the iced coffee that I'm drinking right here, obviously the cold brew, added some heavy whipping cream, Jordan's skinny syrup in the chocolate coconut macaron, that one's my favorite. And I also added half a scoop of perfect keto chocolate collagen. This is one way that I get in some of my collagen for the day by adding it to my iced coffee. They had the nut pods in the almond coconut creamer. This one is coconut macaroon. I've not tried it yet. It's the 11.2 fluid ounce. I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see your nutritional information, but one tablespoon is gonna be 10 calories, one fat, zero carbs, and zero protein. This one is a limited edition flavor, and hopefully you can pause it right there and see the ingredients. Nothing bad is added into Nut Pods. It's one of those really clean companies, and they come out with different flavors during the seasons. This one was only 59 cents, so I went ahead and got two of those. They had the Sargento Ultra Thin Jack Cheddar Cheese Slices. I love the Ultra Thin for some reason, better than I do a thicker cheese. There's 18, like I said, in here. These were $1.99. It's not like this one is cheaper than the one I pick up at Aldi's. It's actually about 20 cents more but it's the ultra thin and Aldi does not have a thin cheese. Three slices is gonna be 130 calories, 10 fat, eight protein, and zero carbs. They also break it down into one slice, but a serving is gonna be three. $1.99, 59 cents, $1.49 cents for the cold brew, and $1.99 for the LaCroix. Seriously, you cannot beat it. So if you have any grocery outlets, if you have any discounts, Discount grocery stores in your area, you need to check those out. That's where you're gonna find some amazing deals. And when you do, stock up, because normally when you go back to get more, it's gone. Thank y'all so much for watching. Let me know, did you find anything new this week that I need to be on the lookout for? I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Say bye, Quinchy. Say bye. Mm -mm.